previously on the Super Dapper Brothers. Uh, God, what is his name? Something Jong? As the uh, face actor. Kim Jong? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I've already got some stuff I'll be like, you ready for some Changs, bitches? <laughs> <laughs> when he's rolling up the window. Uh... Motherfucker. Motherfucker! Will our heroes be stuck Asian? Will bitches get ready for change? Will I ever get this voice down? Find out now on Super Dapper Bros. There's one pet I like to pet, and every evening we get set. I stroke it every chance I get. It's my girl's pussy. Hello. Hey. Today we're gonna be playing with Epic Fail Rudy and Bank on Tank and Dirty Duck. And we're going to be playing a uh, blast on Doomsea Exchange. Ooh. Yes, well, we'll be having exchange. With some dooms. Of bullets. We're gonna, or lasers. We're going to go exchange some spice with Stink. <laughs> yeah, spice is the drug from Dune, which starts uh, here. Yep. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. It was like, it was one reference. It was just like a combined reference. <clears throat> Anyway, um, hey, we're the Rebels again. You can change the guy if you like. You can even, actually, we don't have any unlocked guns, but you could buy one of those, too, if you want them. Yeah, I got money. Not a lot. I kind of just want to use this one. Yeah, it's good. Uh, you got anything else in here? Uh, yeah, I got a whole bunch of shit. Oh. Yeah, okay, so that, that seated cooling cell? Yeah. In the, uh, the beta, you just had it. Now it's like, do we have this You have to have charges. You have to spend credits to get charges, and then you can use the charges in the game. And it gives you, you know, like the cool cell. Increases your cooldown so that the game, so that when you're firing, you can fire for longer. But, yeah, anyway. Oh gosh, this tea is so tasty. Alright. Beat the enemy. Decide the taste that the most enemies wins. Pretty simple. The uh, Rebel Trains wins. Yeah. Yeah, kind of look like cockroaches. They do look like cockroaches. Alright, let's get to it. It said, told me to press square. I pressed S. Yeah! Yeah! I already did better. <laughs> Hopefully, I mean, I left like the match with Mike's game, so. Yeah. You won't be playing with him anymore. Yeah. Yeah, it takes a little getting used to it. We've been, we've been playing a lot of Destiny. God, I was going with throwing arm. I did not expect that. Which yeah. plays very different from that. Uh, a little bit. Space shooters are not quite the same. Shake it off! Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> See, I wasn't used to that sensitivity. I'm just like, oh, pull up your head under your head. Yeah, you can head. adjust sensitivity if you need to. Nah, I'll just get used to it. <laughs> nah, I'll accompany whatever. Yeah, no, I'll be used to it. I'll make it easier. Yeah, fuck that guy. I always tell people when I have the back door. <laughs> That's not a good rule to have, but if you're like any crowd of people. I, I don't think like I, I will do it under those conditions no matter Mind what. Mind Fuhrer. Oh, but well. spelled everything wrong. Yeah. What? He's a little sniper rifle. Yeah. <laughs> is that what we got? Yeah, if you push L1, you get it. Dude's on top of this. Yeah. They have just packs. And they still only has one shot. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> J Franco 26. I hope that is actually James Franco. Um. Yeah, he killed us. Get back here, J Franco. <laughs> I am not done with you yet. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Ah. Uh, no, there's an explosion here. Uh, Enemies hit your health bar. Yeah. Oh, that thing's not. But uh, it's also like it's a usable turret. That one. There's an automated turret, and then there's an automated turret that you can turn super good. 45 degrees or something. Let's see what that is. Yeah! Who killed my folks? Shoot them right in the face. 
Oh shit! They're helmeted faces. Oh, we are talking six. Oh, Ryski joined a party. No, he didn't join our party. Yeah, he joined a party, oh. but not ours. <laughs> and just saying that from the corner, I wanted to acknowledge it. So people at home purposely ignoring Rice Keys. I we played Destiny with him once, did we? Yeah, like a year ago. Now he's just being a kickback. What is this? What is this droid? Uh, I think it shoots stuff, but you just drop it. And it's just, uh, yes, it shoots. Stuff. I don't understand why it shoots stuff. It's an astromech droid. Its job is to fix We're shit. behind schedule and are uh, losing this fight to the Imperials. You're like, oh, hey, Imperials ahead! It's like taking a mechanic into war. Hey, it's the <laughs> <they're> engineer class. <laughs> Nothing's going on. Oh, you missed. But then I killed. No, uh, I, guess I assisted. You just got an assist. Uh, assisted what? in his die. Whoa, how the hell are you supposed to read that? Kali Shredder 92? I think that person used to play Tony Hawk Pro Skater. I think that person was really disappointed when Tony Hawk Pro Skater was like, suck balls. <laughs> <laughs> Take that! He was practicing his cartwheels, man. Don't get down on him for a while. Hey, I'll get down on anything. Because I'm a dance master. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's, I thought you meant dancing too. Uh, no, that's that is. I was getting on the shield. Did it fucking work? <laughs> well, you weren't in the shield. I was clearly in the shield. How big is it? I'm, it's fairly large, but he also might have thrown the grenade before you put the shield down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, hey, there's something we can talk about. What? Uh, no, it's Star Wars. Well, yeah, like Star Wars uh, series. You, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. You know the one about uh, the Gungan series? Oh, man, you're up with that. The Gungan one, no. We'll talk about the Gungan. Well, it's Jar Jar Bing specifically. We're going to talk about the Jar Jar. Uh, Fan theory. We're gonna talk about why Jar Jar's the best character. This, this episode's really short because we only did. Do you want to do one more match? Should we? It was only six episodes. It was only like six minutes. Oh, it was really? Yeah. But only that but short. You guys lost really quickly. So. All right. Should I play a di the same thing? Yeah, just play the same map uh, match type. Just right. on a different map. Okay. Um, I don't think I have a choice. Anyway, so there's a fan theory floating around. Uh, it's I mean it's a little it's a little old now, like two weeks, but mm -hmm. uh, we I don't think I've talked to you about it so. Um, but it's a uh, that Jar Jar Binks is actually a evil mastermind, and he's a Sith, he's a Sith Lord, uh, and like their evidence for it is for this I like the E11. Yeah, I, I like the the standard Imperial blaster. It's like heavier. Yeah. But it, like it shoots slower, but it's like heavy. You know? Yeah. Uh, hey, we've almost unlocked the uh, the space shotgun. Yes, sir. No, the one. Oh, like the one next to that. Not right there. Oh, this. Full damage, but its rate of fire, its range, <laughs> and its cooling power are like nothing. This make this it's a Jawa like, blaster. It looks like those uh, you know those like grill bits that are meant for like cutting holes in PVC. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Um. Anyway, so the Jar Jar theory is it's backed by watching episode one, um, because you see him do. Of course, that's all. Some crazy stuff like uh. Jar Jar's really clumsy. He trips over his feet and like his ears and shit all the time, right? Yeah. But then when he goes swimming, he does this crazy like his thirty foot vertical jump and like does all these crazy backflips into the water. Something that's very similar to what Jedi can do using the Force. Uh -huh. um, oh, I don't think I've used this map. I've played on this map yet. Um, it's pretty cool. Looking. Yeah, trees. I like trees. Okay. I mean, this looks like where we live, actually. Yeah. yeah that's, Minus the spaceships. Well, this is based on the movie, which was filmed by where we live. So. That's true. Indoor, which was filmed oh, in the out of the forest, shit, which is like ten miles from here. No people know where we live. Oh god. Um. Anyway, so. But there's also all these moments where Jar Jar like. Here they come. I regret nothing. Like, okay, so Jar Jar convinces, you know, one of the theory, yeah. parts of the theory is that Jar Jar convinces Boss Mass uh -huh. uh, using a, a Jedi mind trick to let him go through the, uh, the center of the, the planet core uh, with Qui-Gon Jinn and Obi-Wan um, and Naboo. Because why would, like, Jar Jar is a bumbling whatever, why would Boss Mass send him as the, uh, like, 
the representative. As like the representative of him, yeah. yeah. Unless Jar Jar. Yeah, weren't they gonna exile him? Like convinced before yeah. all of those events happened. So unless Jar Jar used a, a Jedi mind trick in order to get them to let him do that, why on earth would they send him through the planet court with Qui Gon and everyone? And why would they give him killed by yourself? I, oh man, smart rocket. More like an idiot rocket. <laughs> Uh, uh, I'm, I apologize for that joke. Uh, I thought I had him. He was so close. Yeah, a little too close. Uh, I mean, as long as I would have gotten him, too. Oh, oh god, I didn't. You blended in. <laughs> Did I make up? Yeah, with the background. My colorblindness is not helpful. You can switch it to your colorblind mode. I mean, I don't know what it would look like for everyone else, but you can do it. Yeah, but guess what? I can't switch for real well. Oh, yeah, but I mean, you can switch it to the video game. Why don't you suffer from something? Yeah, I killed someone in this match. Woo! Yeah. Woo! Um, so, anyway, the idea is that, and then Jar Jar becomes a senator. Like, why on earth would someone let Jar Jar be a senator? Uh, and whenever you see Jedi doing mind tricks, they always wave their hand a little bit, you know, like what Juan does. You don't want to sell me any death sticks. You can hold it, you can get life. Yeah, the best part of Star Wars Episode 2. Uh, minus the brilliantly written sand monologue. Um, <laughs> uh, anyway, and, but Jar Jar's always doing his hands right now. So, we're doing stuff like that. so, there's a lot of interesting uh, support for it, and, the, and nothing ever happens to Jar Jar. He never dies. We never see anything happen to him once Order 66 goes out. So maybe Jar Jar and Jar Jar. Oh yeah, the biggest point is when um, Emperor Palpatine becomes the Emperor when they give him the emergency powers. Jar Jar needs to vote in the Senate. Uh huh. So the theory is that Jar Jar has been working with Palpatine this whole time, trying to become a senator and using the Jedi to get there. And then when he becomes senator, that way he is the one to instigate Palpatine to get his emergency powers. He's the other senator is going to do. Help. So, anyway, that's the theory, and that uh, when Order 66 goes out, we don't see anything happen to Jar Jar, uh, so maybe Jar Jar's gonna come back. But, you fellow red. Yeah. Oh, fuck! <laughs> 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 I'm gonna get your grenade. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna get that guy to it. Anyway, yeah, so, that was an interesting game theory that was floating around. That, uh... Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys have heard any of these fan theories. Uh, what you think of them. Yeah. Uh, use a war style reload. Yeah. Well, I mean, back to the behind and running out of time. Uh, the Push them back. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've never even played Gears of War. Yeah, you should. Have. Meatheads. Meathead. No, I mean like like literally steak <laughs> no, yeah. and turkey. Dude, and they're so chunky. Like the character that was designed in that game was like. Well, it's kind of like wow, isn't it? But like a little, a little grittier. Like a grittier version. Of it. <laughs> yeah, well, they are wearing camouflage. It makes sense. We're running around in bright white armor. Why can't it protect yeah, us? We should be in the snow level. And they're all in camouflage. Like, <laughs> snow level. <laughs> if you have the shadow suit, we have the shadow suit armor. It'd be a little better. You, you killed him. Uh, but this game does something kind of nice that the most shadow shooters don't do, which is a critical kill assist. So if you did by far the most damage. And someone else steals your kill at the last point. Points. You still get the same amount of points as a kill. Okay. You just don't get an actual kill from the tank. So at the end, it doesn't work for your kill death ratio, but it does give you the same amount of points. Which is. Because points transform themselves. For every 100 points, you get one. 
personal hope, it's not even a theory. My personal hope is that we're gonna get Dark Ball in the, uh, in the series. Because, because IGN puts out an article every two fucking days saying, hey, guys, Dark Ball's still out yeah, there. Yeah, IGN just keep reminding us. But it's the same article. <laughs> they, they just keep reposting the article it's been out for two years. Uh, yeah. Because Dark Ball's not dead. He, uh, like, canonically, he isn't dead. Even though you see him die in episode one, you don't actually see him die. You just seem to be cut in half, which apparently does not involve any of his primary organs as a Zabrak. Uh, which you can play in this game. Um, oh. Best Eric in the biz. Man, I'm, I'm like not even relying on looking at the What about like Eric? I'm looking at this, and I don't even... Like, every time I get killed, I don't even see red there. Uh, the red doesn't always show up. When Enemy in, units nearby! It only really shows up if there's a reason to fire it. There's a guy who's right there. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No! <laughs> well, the droid blew up. You're good. Uh, anyway, see, I guess Zabrax don't have any important organs in the bottom half of their bodies, unlike humans, which have their yeah. most important organs huh, in the bottom half of their bodies. That's a oddly specific thing. Huh? The organ thing. Oh, I don't know if that's, like, established in the continuity. But he gets cut in half and he's still fine. Like a human can't survive after being cut in half. He just but doesn't need a poop. <laughs> Simple. <laughs> Alright, well, hey. Hey. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, and uh, Darth Maul's still alive, so keep an eye out for him. Yeah. In case he does show up. He probably won't, but. He better. But if he does, it'd be cool. Anyway, we'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye!